What's new in the official build of Fluid OS version 1.6 based on Android 11 running on the Xiaomi Poco F1? Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video. And we have a new build of Fluid OS. The version is 1.6. Of course, we have installed the official version and it is based on Android 11 available for the Poco F1. The first change you will notice is that the security patch has been updated to June 2021. The kernel they are using is Silver Core. SE Linux, of course, is set as enforcing. Next change you will notice is that the UI has changed so settings in bold when you scroll up it is stickied on the top left but the text changes to small and the transition effect of settings going from a big bold to a smaller size font is pretty smooth then you will also notice that you also have the android 12 style search bar along with the profile icon and when you scroll up the icon is on the right hand side fluid customization is now pinned on top of all the other options so if i tap here i am inside fluid customization next up if you swipe down you will notice that the brightness slider and the auto brightness icon have also been redesigned on the top right you do have your profile icon along with how long your battery is going to last and on the top left you do have the clock along with the date and and the day then if you go into battery have a look at that super cool animation pretty dope pretty dope next up for the poco f1 they have also added the option to hide the notch so go into fluid customization second option from the bottom status bar display cutout three different options normal the one which we're using right now hide wherein everything shifts down now do note that the corners are not rounded and you can also choose the immersive style in which case the notch area is still used for your status bar icons and you do have rounded corners you can of course enable or disable the stock status bar height toggle as well then they have also added the option of hiding apps but do note it is only available if you have fluid launcher installed which is why this time around i have installed the vanilla build so for starters let me go into settings apps and notification default apps here it is default app is fluid let us go into the settings hidden applications bam let us hide the calculator app all right Yep. so you have to tap on the app name if you tap on the icon here not gonna work or it works i think i'm just too quick for it anyways tap on the app name and it works without any issues so you can see that the calendar has now disappeared from the application drawer press and hold go into home settings tap on calendar one more time and it should now appear back so there it is calendar is now back in my application drawer next up they have also added per app volume so if i go into youtube and let me play a video so here it is you can see we are playing a video and if i try to access the volume panel bam here it is i can independently control the volume for youtube and of course any other ap application which you have installed which has media output you will have a separate icon for that next up let us check for the safety net again device is not rooted right now only installed magisk to check for safety net safety net is passing out of the box let us also open the google play store go into settings about phone play protect certification device is certified this means you should be able to use your banking apps without any issues in terms of youtube media playback everything works absolutely fine live caption picture in picture your per app music of course for picture in picture either you need to have youtube premium or you need to be in a specific country in case you do not want to pay for youtube premium now next up let us also check for the portrait light feature but before that when you open google photos google has ended the unlimited high quality so the next option is storage saver now let me skip this and if i now try to edit a picture of my favorite football star and let us try to edit it one more time i think it is syncing it from the cloud so there it is wait for this loading bar to finish go into adjust portrait light feature is present and working without any issues another important thing i would like to mention is that this only works on human objects so if i try to edit my chicken friend over here 
I do not get the option of portrait light because it's a toy and not a human object and Google does have pretty intelligent AI. Next up, let us check if Hey Google is working or not. So it is working with the screen turned on. Let us turn the screen off. Hey Google, are you awake? Yep, so the lady is awake, but I'm not sure why the UI is appearing on the top half of the screen i did of course update all the applications from the play store so as you can see everything is updated and there are no updates available so that might be a minor issue on this build next up we can check for the app opening animations and as you can see there are no jitters and no lags in the app opening animations you do have access to your google feed from fluid launcher as well and again the google feed is pretty fluid also no jitters and no lags here either in terms of the recents bam here it is smooth fast and of course with fluid launcher you do not get the option of select but you do get the option of screenshot and it works without any issues switching between applications again no jitters no lags everything is super fast and super smooth and of course the name of the rom is fluid and the ui is pretty fluid as well so there it is peeps that is what was new in fluid os version 1.6 based on android 11 running on the xiaomi poco f1 and that will do it for this video hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you